Hi, this is Tamika with Pastries, Pumps, and Pine. I'm here with a Plan With Me video for my September Currently page. I am behind getting this done, but hey, I'm still doing it, right? So I actually love the Currently page in my Teresa Collins planner more than I like the one in the Wild Style. And some people might say that it's crazy because there's really not that big of a difference, and I will show you. There really isn't, but... I like having this big space up here and then the two sections at the bottom as opposed to it being divided up here. That's just my preference. So I prefer, since I still had some months left of the Teresa Collins planner, I'm gonna continue to use these currently pages. And then when I'm stuck with that one, then I'll be stuck with the one from Wild Style. But for now, this is the one that I wanna go with. All right, so I'm gonna start with um, some washi. I'm gonna use this rose gold washi tape. Um, and I'm gonna cover the peach lines here. All right. All right, so I'm going to put that down. All right, and then I have just kind of picked out some stuff, and um, I'm going to use, like, my Dream Seeker. Sorry, I'm using Dream Seeker. I received two new copies of this sticker book from one of my subscribers, Jacqueline. Thank you again, Jacqueline. So I received that uh, for my birthday. And I already had three copies of that book and was hoarding it. So no more hoarding those stickers. <laughs> like I have absolutely no excuse now for that. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna put this brave down here. It says, you are so brave. So I'm going to be jotting down what I and feeling at the end of this month and I, I'm gonna jot down how I'm feeling right now as well and then I have a left space for me to journal about those feelings right here and I have this dream I'm gonna put this down here all right. I also had some other stickers that I wanted to use. This one says, you got this. And this one says, you are rare. I'm gonna put that down here. Well, it kind of covers the punch a little bit move it over just a tad so it's not covering the punch. Well, I moved it over more than a tad. Hello. Okay, there we go. You are rare. And then for monthly goals, I'm going to take these flags and you're gonna put these down and write down a few a few things now there are some goals that I do have for this month All right, and now that I've put all of that down, that's all that I pulled 
um, I'm going to go look at just some of the deco stuff. So, like, let's put down some of the florals, right? So, I'm going to put this down over there because I, I, I'm not hoarding these anymore. Nope. These are not being hoarded anymore. <laughs> we can no longer do that, Tamika. Nope, nope, nope. Not allowed. <laughs> and I'm going to go ahead and y'all know I like the little sparkly stuff. So I'm going to put some of that down. I'm going to white out these other dots because I don't need them. Okay. Um, I think that's all I'm going to put as far as the deco is concerned. covers up special days. Do I care that it covers up special days? I don't think I care. <laughs> so I'm going to put that down. Choose joy. All right. And as a matter of fact, I'm going to raise this up. I'm going to raise this up. I'm going to put some more washi down. Okay. going to get a pen and I'm going to write down my goals. So one goal is the 10 day challenge. I want to accomplish that again this month. Going to be difficult because I'm actually back at work and I don't know how I'm going to manage that at work. <laughs> Um, I kind of figure out how to do it for lunch. Take wraps and take this one dish that can be eaten cold or room temperature. I could do that. But as far as like breakfast, what am I going to do? Because I know me. I am personally not going to get up early enough to fix me a breakfast here at home. And it's going to be difficult for me to find a vegan breakfast um, on the way to work. Um, I'm trying to think because the last time I was doing oatmeal and fruit most mornings um, and then smoothies. So I don't know. Has anyone ever made a smoothie the night before and had it ready? Because that's the only thing that's going to work for me is if I make my smoothies the night before. So I need to see if that if that's a possibility and if that's going to work out for me. Um, um, yeah, another thing that I want to get done by the end of this month is 
new employment. Yep. And then I write this every month and it's just really sad that work always gets in the way of me doing this. Um, but I need to finish my ebook. Yep. So those are my monthly goals. Oh, I do need to add another one. Now that I think about it. Um, so let me go ahead and add two more because otherwise it's going to look weird. It's going to look really weird if I don't add two more. So let's see. Let's move this one up here. Okay. Let me go to the spot where I found these. Okay. And eat another one of that color. And then another one of the green. So I was using the peach and greens together out of here. So let's put one here. So I know that I need to have doctor appointments. I need to get those done. And I need a new vision um, check. So vision check because I need to get some more glasses because I broke my glasses. <laughs> but I might as well get my vision checked because it hasn't been checked in a while. So I'll add those into my other monthly goals. All right. I think this turned out really pretty, but y'all know I love this sticker book. I mean, I love it. This is really crooked and it's bothering me. So I'm sorry, y'all, but I'm going to pull it up. <laughs> and it doesn't want to stick to the washi. I'm noticing that as well. So we'll just put it right beneath. There we go. I love this peach and green together. I didn't think I would like that combo. The florals add a little bit of nice touch in there. This turned out really, really nice. I like it a lot, a lot, a lot. <laughs> So here's my um, currently page. Um, oh, let's see. I'm supposed to write my mantra and what I'm feeling. So my mantra is nothing anyone says or does can change what God already knows this is my own quote so if you quote this you better quote that i said it because this is something i say all the time this is my own personal quote nothing anyone says or does can change what god already knows so they can say and they can think whatever they want to think of me but most people don't like me because i speak the truth and that's okay but that's my mantra <laughs> Nothing anyone says or does can change what God already knows. For those people who think they can do their dirt and their evil and they're going to get away with it, you might be thinking you're getting away with it at the moment, but God sees and hears all. And so right now, what I'm feeling, so I'm going to write the date. Um, I don't even know what today's date is, so I'll have to write that later. Uh, right now, I'm feeling um, overwhelmed overworked and unappreciated that is how I'm feeling and then we'll see how I feel at the end of the month and I will um, I will write that in over there all right that's it <laughs> That's how I'm going to handle my currently page for September. So I will come back at the end of the month, state how I'm feeling. We'll see if we reached all of these goals. It's even hard to like make calls and appointments because we have cameras in our classrooms and there's no privacy whatsoever. And they're constantly watching. They make it known that they're constantly watching us. So I have to remember to go out to my car to handle personal business on my cell phone. I can't even just handle that in my classroom by myself. 
Um, so I have to go to my car to make my doctor's appointments um, and things like that. So anything like my brother, they in my family, they can't even call me and I talk to them in my classroom because it's no privacy. So I tell them, text me because that's about as much privacy as I'm going to have in that place. Um, so yeah, it, that's why it's been hard for me to get my appointments done because I forget to go to my car and make the phone calls. Yeah, y'all, that's what I'm dealing with. I'm telling you. Yeah, so that that that's where we're at. <laughs> that's where we're at, guys. I like I say all the time, I can't make this stuff up. Um, I really think if I really wrote a book about my teaching experience, it would be a block. It could be turned into a blockbuster movie, like because it's that unbelievable. Yeah. All right. So there you have it, guys. You know what to do. Be sure to slay, subscribe, like, and accept the alert so you don't miss any videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Thank you.